guys, the Jonas Brothers and the rest of Camp Rock 2 just wrapped their tour in South America. We went behind the scenes for an exclusive look to find out how they achieved such amazing wardrobe and makeup. Hey everybody, I can't be your style. What's up? I'm Kevin Jonas from the Jonas Brothers. I want to show you what we do backstage with our wardrobe and our style. Uh, Michelle does an incredible job with us. She's been with us for almost four or five years now. It's very important that each of them have their own individual style that it stands out. For example, Kevin, he is like kind of like the chic rocker. You probably know this shirt a little bit more than any other. I loved it. I thought it was very cool. Just the pin placement, the tatteredness of it all, it really added a colorful aspect to the show, but then at the same time kept it kind of rock and roll. So you kind of have to like marry the camp rock vibe with a rocker vibe. She did a lot with leather this time. So I've got two different styles of leather vests. So I've got the rugged All Saints joint and then the custom work she did. Being on stage, you have to make it stage worthy. You have to make it like, you can't find it anywhere else. And then when it comes to Nick and Joe's style, really, Joe has very sleek looks, his very glamorous looks. Nick's more rugged rock and roll with some flannels and the cutoffs and Harley Davidson shirts. It's really cool. Sometimes I take cues for my inspirations of what the songs are going to be. Like for Love Bug, you know, that was like in the 1940s. And instead of making the Jonas Brothers in full tuxedos like they did in the, in the video, we kind of made it a little bit more rock star. We kept the white dinner jackets, but then they wore like really cool rocked out t-shirts. I am loving the white jacket with the jeans look. It's super cute. All right, so next up, we are going backstage to meet up with celebrity makeup artist Marissa Machado, who took some time out of her crazy busy schedule to show us how she gets one of the dancers stage ready. Are you gonna start with eyes first? Yeah, definitely. I just like to put a cream on first because it's gonna hold it. It's gonna hold all the loose pigments on top. What oh. color are you doing? It's a real kind of twilight sort of silver tone and I'm just kind of patting it on. That way it's sticking into the cream. Cool. One thing that I always like to do with makeup is whatever I do to the top, I like to do to the bottom. Like so underneath? Yeah, exactly. Oh, cool. I always like to start in the middle of the eye and work my way out, and then I work my way back in. Time for a little blush. If you smile, mm -hmm. you get the apples of the cheeks. Right. So then you know exactly where the placement is. So you smile, and then you're going to blend it back, okay? okay. So instead of rubbing lips, mm -hmm. I say press your lips, because sometimes when you rub them, it just kind of dries them out, and you can get a little bit flaky. Awesome. Ashley looked absolutely amazing. Now Marissa is going to show you how to take that same stage look and transform it into an everyday look. For the Camp Rock Tour in Latin America, we've been doing a lot of dark eyeshadow, right. eyeliner, eyebrow thing. Very thick. Okay, and right. I kind of want to know how to make that cool eye, but to wear it during the day. I think a lot of people are going to want to know this as well, so cool. it's going to work out. Yay. Okay, so I'm going to take the same kind of silvery, taupey color that I used on Ashley, but instead of taking it all the way up, we're just going to keep it real tight in the lash line. So I am taking it up kind of into the crease, but it's lighter as we go. So I'm going to take a little bit of this and just press it into the bottom lashes as okay. well. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take a black liquid liner. We're going to do a real simple cat eye. I like to start in the middle of the eye and work my way out. It's the last step for the eyes. I'm gonna top it off with some mascara. All right, I'm gonna have you look down. If I was like gonna go out tonight, can I see? transform it to a night look? I would do a lipstick, something okay. that's gonna stand out more, and then you're gonna feel complete. So now we're gonna do a really pretty pink blush. So I'm gonna have you smile. Perfect. You just wanna go in an upward and outward motion. Last but not least, really, really neutral gloss. It's basically the color of your lips just punched up a notch with a really pretty shine. To me, this is perfect that's for every day. Okay. okay. Well, thank you guys so much for coming behind the scenes with us on the Jonas Brothers and Camp Rock 2 tour. Coming up next is your need of the week. My need of the week is a black leather motorcycle jacket. I think that every girl should have one in their closet. You could wear it with just about everything, from a little floral mini dress to a t-shirt and a pair of skinny pants. You can dress yours up like Vanessa Hudgens with her sequin mini dress, or dress it down like Taylor Swift with knee-high boots and skinny jeans. Soften up the look with a feminine scarf like Rachel Bilson, or toughen your look up like Sinead Grimes by adding metallic accents and jewelry. Stay tuned to Cambio Style for some more tips to keep you looking fashion fabulous.